It's another day, eyes on my display You say we need a change and I feel that you mean it You mean it But you're so right, we're losing track of time Buying things online and it's not like we need them Okay, hey guys, welcome back to my channel I just wanna be happy Sorry that I'm whispering. I'm a little bit embarrassed. But um me and Tate are going to that lighting's way better. Me and Tate are going to the Blue Mountains for the weekend and I wanted to walk, so that's what I'll be doing. Cute Tate. Right. One last week, but Sorry for that interruption. But yeah, so me and Tate are going to the Blue Mountains for the weekend and we'll be vlogging. Yes, I already said that. But yeah, we're about to leave now. I don't know what the time is. So I'm using my phone. So we just got a long sleeve top on. There we go. Long sleeve top on. Uh, trackies and socks. This is from Ali, of course, my favourite store. Who else? Uh, Kmart. And my socks are from Kmart. And then my we don't need them so can we just slow I was going to talk and then I saw the camera. Three! <laughs> okay, guys, I know you can't really see anything, but I do just want to say we just got here, I think. I, I don't know, it's starting to stress me out a lot because it is pitch black, if you can't tell by this clip. It's absolutely pitch black. No light, we got here way too late, so that wasn't great. And we're literally in the middle of nowhere. It looks, as far as I can tell, in the dark. It looks nothing like the pictures online, like at all, like not even remotely close. So I don't know where we are or what the hell's going on. There is one other car here. It gives me a little bit of hope because, like, you know, civilization. <laughs> Tate hasn't gone over to speak to them. I'm surely not going over there to speak. Oh, they could be a murderer for all I know. But I am absolutely terrified right now. I'm just sitting in the car with the lights on. I don't know if you could see that. But yeah, so waiting for Tate to get back. And yeah, just freaking out, really. This is absolutely terrifying. I cannot describe how dark it is. Like, really pitch black like i'm pretty sure we're surrounded by mountains like everywhere like we're in a bowl right now so it is pitch 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 black dark cannot see a thing so this is really scary it's also freezing cold i really don't want to get out of the car because it's so cold it looks nothing like the photos it i literally got catfished by a campground this is like not okay i guess i'll update you later i don't know when or how or what it's gonna be, but I will try and do so. This is so scary, dude. I hope that's tight, because if it's not, I don't know what to do. <laughs> well, the lightning is in and out, obviously. But we are set up in the tent <laughs> with uh, like a whole bunch of stuff. We've got a bunch of pillows and blankets, like literally so many layers of blankets. I'm laying on top of another blanket right now for extra cushioning because um, obviously the ground is uncomfortable. I should sit up. <laughs> oh, that's a bit freaky. Yeah, my shirt's coming off. Don't mind my purple lips, it's not because I'm that cold. I am. 
but that's not why. It's from Chapstick. Chapstick is purple. Um, it's a little bit awkward. You can probably hear there are kids behind me. Um, they've been very annoying. Tate is going to go, has gone to, what is that? Oh, Tate has gone to go look for like firewood and stuff to start a fire because it's freaking cold. I don't know if you can see any of that. Very cold. It's like, it gets to like one degree tonight. I don't know what it is right now because I don't have reception or anything like that. Internet, but I'm sorry, those kids are so loud. Um, but I'm rugged up in bed at the moment. The tent is wide open um, just so I can like, when Tate comes back, he can talk to me and stuff. Um, and obviously when he comes back, I'll help him. But while I'm waiting, I'm rugged up. I think he's on his way now. I can see the torch. Yes, that is him. Huh? I was vlogging. Nice. I said, I think I can see him now. And yes, it is you. Huh? Do you want the fire on this side or on this side? I picked out a spot for it before. My nose is running like crazy. Tate is trying to get the fire started. We need to stop. I am, why am I going so fast? I need to be looking for stuff. I'm venturing out of the campground. I'm trying to look for like sticks, you know, something for the fire because it's not doing too hot at the minute. Is that attached? Yes. Needless to say, this is actually kind of terrifying because I am by myself. What's that? Oh, that's not helpful. I'm by myself and there's not very many sticks about. It's quite disheartening. Like, I don't know what you can see on camera if all this stuff looks like sticks to you, but it ain't. So, yeah, that sucks. I'm just trying to find like sticks, but they like actually don't exist. It's actually a joke. Say actually one more time. But yeah, it's kind of. Yeah, so you can't see anything down there. I ventured a pretty long ways away. And it's pretty scary when you're by yourself. I'm just gonna grab a bunch of this crap and hope that it does something. Um, but like I'm under a big tree right now. I don't think you can see like anything at all. I'm under a big tree. 
and there's no sticks. Like you'd think some branches would have fallen, something useful, but there's no sticks. It's very disappointing, really. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna keep grabbing this stuff, but this isn't sticks, it's just like stripped off bark. Nothing fun or really useful, but I'm also not going much further than that because this is kind of scary. Like, I'm going to keep looking behind me, but also because I'm out, like, literally in the middle of nowhere, everything's echoing, so my footsteps are echoing, which is terrifying because obviously I'm thinking that there's something behind me when there's not. Well, I don't know. Um, but like, there's like cows and stuff that roam around here. I don't want to get rammed by a cow. So I'm coming back now because I'm too freaking scared with some shit. That's not going to help the fire at all because it's all wet. But it's something, you know? I tried. I tried my best. to bed now. It's freezing but we'll warm up. Yes, I am going to go to sleep in my makeup. Don't yell at me in the comments. I cannot be bothered to take it off and the thought of rubbing a cold wet wipe across my face right now does not sound pleasant in the slightest. So I'm not interested at all. So I'm going to get a lot more pimples than I already have to add to the collection and it's fine. Okay. I'm going to think back to this moment and be like, you know what? I don't blame myself for that was the right decision so it'll be fine don't yell at me in the comments i know my actions i'm aware but yes me and Tate are going to go to bed now and possibly wake up to see the sunrise but i guess we'll see in the morning um i might be a grumpy puss and be like no i'm not getting up it's cold that's what's gonna happen probably won't see the sunrise but it's fine because like it'll still be a pretty day tomorrow because we're going to do stuff i don't know what we're doing but we're in the blue mountains so it'll still be pretty there'll be views and stuff to see the three three the, the three sisters do some walking and some lookouts and i'll update you guys in the morning and let you know what happened but it's probably sleeping in but anyways
Tate is crossing it right now, not that you can see. It's very wobbly and scary looking. But it says one person at a time. Look how red my cheeks are. Yeah, it says one person at a time. So I can't cross it yet. Wow, I am so red. I am in the middle of the bridge right now. And this thing is so wobbly. This <laughs> Yeah. Oh, 
Where you, you can see the end of the bridge where we came off and where other people are waiting to cross and this man is currently crossing with those two little me. girls in front of him okay we're leaving now and we're going back to the car and I am dead you about to walk? I'm about to start leaving You may wait now. Thank you, Marie. So beautiful. This right here is the best view. If it was like this the whole way, this would be fine. But it's not. <gasps> I just remembered. Look how pretty. I'm driving because I am so good at driving. <laughs> Tate looks stressed. <laughs> um, but I had to stop really quick to show you guys this because I think it's beautiful. This reminds me a lot of Hill How far is that? Well, this, two hours away. this reminded me a lot when we were at Hill End. Uh, I'll try and put a picture up on the screen because I don't have a vlog of that. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show you. Hindsight is bleeding, oh, and your heart's bleeding, and all you can see is red. Till you discover it is within each other to forgive and make amends. If I had known then, or what I know now, I wouldn't have said what I said. I took the long road, thought I'd be better on my own. Sometimes what's right is wrong instead. Cause I Okay, I know 
this isn't very helpful because I, I didn't do a good job of filming or transitioning anything. But me and Tay ate dinner. We had this like Mexican food, right? Went to this Mexican restaurant. I don't remember where it was. But anyways, it was not good. So it was not worth filming. I don't know, it was just very bland. Like it didn't have any lime on it. And they didn't even offer guacamole. Like, not that I would have it. I don't like avocado. But I feel like it's a pretty standard thing for a Mexican restaurant to offer guacamole. And they didn't even do that. I just found it weird. I don't know. It wasn't my favourite. And they didn't give you, like, a fork or anything. Even though they don't chop up their meat. Like, it's a whole big thing of meat. And it's nachos, right? How are you supposed to eat it? If you're not going to chop up your meat, how am I supposed to dip it? into feeling and everything like that because you you go to dip it and uh, y your chip breaks because the meat's too heavy because it's not chopped up it's just one big lump of meat that's not chopped up like it doesn't make sense yeah tate's experience was meh he said it was okay um but it left him still really hungry afterwards so that's not ideal um so he ended up having kfc again for the second day in a row and I ended up getting a mousse again just because I felt like something chocolatey and he got me a mousse so that was nice KFC mousse two days in a row not complaining though I look disgusting I'm about to take my makeup off Naya's here with me hi mom eyes say hi and yeah, and wind down for the night, cuddle Naya and go to sleep. I am so tired. Naya, no. No. That's not for you. Um. Yeah, so I just thought I would outro the video here because it ends here. Oh my god, look how bad my makeup is. Like, oh, it's rubbed off so much because I like slept in the car too. So, that's not helping the situation at all. My highlight's gone. Yeah, not good. I look disgusting. I'm so tired. What was I saying? But yeah, I didn't really do a good job of filming. At the end, I had Tate trying to learn Good For You by Olivia Rodrigo. And it was just very funny to watch him fail so many times. Like, he was trying so hard to learn the words to the chorus and, like, how it goes. Like, how to sing along. And he kept getting frustrated. He's like, oh, sometimes she sings it slow and then she speeds up all of a sudden and then she slows back down. Like, I don't know. It was just really funny to watch him try and learn how to sing that. Because he likes that song. Um, but yeah, that's about it, really. I got dropped off. And then, yeah, this is where we are now. So I'm going to take my makeup off. Get. Get. Get to the toilet. That's not like a normal sentence. Go to the toilet. Brush my teeth probably heat up my hot water bottle this is pretty cold it's not as cold as it was in the blue mountains but it's still pretty cold here and then snuggle up with Naya and go to sleep put on a movie or something but yeah I can't be bothered to film any of that so I just I just want to go to bed so I'm gonna sign it off here thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this little vlog sorry I was such a poor vlogger <laughs> but um yeah, a lot of it, I was just like in the moment sort of thing. But yeah, it is what it is. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. But be sure to subscribe um, and turn on post notifications so you can be alerted of that next video. And don't forget to like the video as well and follow me on my Instagram. And yeah, I don't think I have much more to say. So I'm just going to see you guys next time. Bye guys.